Once again, the internet is losing it over footage of Ben Affleck looking completely miserable. And this time, it sparked a bit of a debate. As married couples often do, Ben and Jennifer Lopez stepped out on Tuesday to grab coffee, strolling the streets of Santa Monica hand in hand. And while we know drinking an iced coffee is one of Ben's favorite pastimes, the joy didn't appear to be showing on his face in one particular clip from the outing, which is now making the rounds online. In the video footage, which currently has more than 3 million views on TikTok, Ben looks fed up and visibly exhausted as he walks towards the car a few steps ahead of J-Lo. Despite his moody demeanor, Ben proceeds to open up the passenger side door to allow J-Lo to get in. However, while she can be seen getting comfortable in her seat, he slams the car door on her, swinging his arm as he walks around to the driver's side. Before getting into the vehicle himself, Ben makes direct eye contact with the person filming and raises his hand as if to question them. As the video gained attention on Twitter, fans launched into speculation about why the actor looks so deflated, with many theorizing that perhaps he and J. Lo had been arguing at the time. Ben tired of her shit, one person tweeted echoed by someone else who described him as literally the unhappiest, most pressed husband in Hollywood. The way he closed the door, I know she's driving him insane, wrote someone else. Ben looked like he hasn't had peace in a while. And while the car door slamming may have given the indication that he was annoyed at J. Lo, it seems a lot more likely that Ben's frustrations in the moment were aimed at the person filming them, not his wife. Looks to me like he's frustrated by the paparazzis, one person tweeted in reply, followed by someone else who noted the way he glares at the end of the video. I think y'all reaching, I think he's tired of the paparazzi, hence the what the fuck bro posture, wrote another. He literally just doesn't like paparazzi, someone else added. Look at how he shakes his head too. He's like that every time a camera's on him. To back up this theory, a ton of fans also highlighted videos and pictures that looked to have been taken moments earlier, in which Ben and J-Lo appear to be chatting happily before they noticed the cameras. If you keep up with Benifer, you'll know that since they got back together in 2021, people have enjoyed speculating about their relationship with fans theorizing on numerous occasions that the pair had been caught fighting in public. For example, in January, a video of Jennifer and Ben having a seemingly tense conversation at the premiere of her movie, Shotgun Wedding, led viewers to speculate that they were arguing over Ben's drinking. And on a second occasion in March, the internet lost it over clips from the Grammys, in which J. Lo appeared to scold her husband for looking bored and miserable during the live broadcast. Ben later confirmed that this was not the case. Nonetheless, instances like these help to better contextualize why lots of people were quick to assume they'd been arguing in the most recent video clip. However, a number of Twitter users took the opportunity to call out the recurrent narrative that Ben must find J-Lo irritating and tiresome. I think it's so weird and sort of pathetic that some of you want this man to hate his wife so much, one person tweeted. He is clearly annoyed with the paparazzi, not her. Some of you are so used to being unloved by the person you love and it shows. Something about this couple has a hold on the world. It's iconic biosh. It's so weird how everyone is just sure they're mad each other by paparazzi pics, wrote someone else. In agreement, Another suggested that it's disturbing how people are rooting for their marriage and family to crumble. This dude just looks stressed all the time, way before J-Lo, so people jumping to blame it on her is so weird, someone else added. As well as debunking the Grammys debacle. Ben was forced earlier this year to address chatter about his gloomy demeanor when he's out in public, saying during an appearance on the Bill Simmons podcast that it's all a big misconception. One of the reasons why people always think I look sad or pissed off is because the pictures that you see it's self-selecting, he said. 
You only see me at the times where I'm standing there with my kids and five guys are following me and shouting things, which brings a feeling out in you that is not a happy feeling. And there you have it.